Many people may know that Bedfordshire was home to a lot of notorious highwaymen. There was Dunn of Dunstable and Biggleswade's own gentleman highwayman, Shock Oliver, who terrorised the Great North Road during the 1870s. But arguably the most famous was Bedford's Black Tom. Black Tom, named as such due to his coal black hair and reputation as a scoundrel, robbed the rich and powerful around Bedford before being executed, hung for his crimes at the crossroads of what is now the junction of Tavistock Street, Union Street and Clapham Road. He was hung and a stake driven through his heart to make sure he could never come back. Though it wasn't enough to stop Black Tom, it would seem, as his ghost was seen at the junction, head lolling at a sickening angle, staggering around aimlessly before vanishing seconds later. It's said that during the 1840s, the local townsfolk refused to leave their homes at night for fear of the ghost of Black Tom. Sightings of Black Tom continued until the 90s, with a local couple believing they saw a drunk in fancy dress before the figure vanished without a trace moments later. Interestingly enough, these people had never heard the story of Black Tom. An interesting side note is that Black Tom's case helped many change prison reform in England. It was used by reformist John Howard after it came about that Black Tom could not afford the bribe to pay the jailer to petition his case to the judge. This would have potentially reduced his sentence and maybe even saved his life. It's because of this injustice, highwaymen like Black Tom were seen as Robin Hood figures and popular amongst local townsfolk. And maybe, perhaps, it's because of the injustice that Black Tom haunts the junction to this very day.